Welcome back, everybody, to Farming Simulator 17. Here on Sinelton's Farms. How y'all doing? Your host with the most, or not the most, Mr. Blue. Folks, I hope y'all doing all right. No, we are not back with another logging episode. I did get the trailers down here and get them hooked up and everything. And... I'm just going to kind of park this out of the way. We, we need to cut some stumps and stuff before we even decide to start doing that. And I'm not going to put y'all through that torture. But just to let you know, everything is off on this end. I have to get oh, lots and lots of wood. I really need to get a bobcat down here and do this right instead of this way because this is not realistic. Oh. Get your booty back up there. You're getting sold. Oh, I can't get you up there. Why is that? What's holding you? There we go. Now, I'm just going to go ahead and clear all these out real quick um, so we all see the final prize. We are able to plant sunflowers and soybeans and corn. If I can get to my little magical hand here to work. All right, that is all the tables and logs is zero. So we are completely out here and over here. Uh, where is it? Right there. And we do not have no wood chips. I don't know where the wood chips went from out of this thing. Oh, it's a pair. One, zero. Uh, uh, got one board there, 250 liters. I don't know if I can pick you up. I don't think I can pick you up yet. No, it's still on the belt. And we're, out of, we're going to have to have wood chips in here. So in that case... We're going to have to get this thing running here. It is completely out. Zero there. Zero there. And zero in the truck. Um, let's see here. we got to find our... Let's see. we got lots of liquid fertilizer. Um, that thing must be out. Yeah, that's zero. Oh, our digestate's out too. Man, I should have left that hooked up. Oh well. Um, I'm off the thing there. I don't know how much. We got quite a bit dry fertilizer where it looks it's stacked up pretty good there. So that's going to be pretty good to go next uh when we start harvesting we'll go plant again uh let's shut this thing off how much is actually in there the same right there so we probably had a hundred thousand liters in there got to bring some more grass and stuff up here folks so um we gotta get some more I see that in a zero and this one is zero. So we're in trouble. Well, I'm going to take all this stuff here to the farm eventually. But today, we're going to have to get busy. Um, not one I wanted. Uh, let's see here. This is one I'm wanting. I start her up. We can go ahead and plant sunflowers. As you can see, our sugar beets are popping up too. Our corn's up. Um, so let's get started, shall we? We're going to do sunflowers. And uh, just uh, for the record, you can see sunflowers and soybeans and corn. But corn and soybeans is in the blue. And uh, sunflower is 45 degrees, okay? But uh, we're over, we're right at 45, 46 degrees. 
seven o'clock in the morning. I'm gonna go ahead and plant them. I hope nothing goes wrong. I know the corn that we planted over there is probably going to wither, but I'm just going to test it and see. Oh, why my miles per hour is always getting set lower than what they're supposed to be. But uh, I'm going to go down through here. Um, hire a worker. Uh, I think the other end should be all right. I just want to plant across this end to give them enough room to make sure that they'll turn around all right. Um, the other field right over there is going to be soybeans. Whoa, I didn't want to hit <laughs> my bad. I hit the fence. Just trying to get as close as I can. Uh, I'm gonna hire a worker. Who who got? Oh, we got Jennifer today. Okay. Um. Yeah, we don't have no uh, animals to worry about, but we do have eggs. Let's see how many we got gathered up. We got 50 eggs in the backpack. So cool. Alright, let's take a look at our map. Um, I was wanting to buy 17, and 17 has rye on it. Wow, what, what was uh, 18? 19, let's see, canola on 19, okay, and that oven looks like barley, yep, wow, all right, I don't know if I've done any missions on these, let's visit, oh, let's just say, what is that line, um, This thing is yeah, seated. Tell you what, I'll probably go and do this mission. And then turn around. Ooh, I have 83. Of course, I can, I can do. Uh, let's go ahead and start this mission here, folks. I know you probably don't want to see missions. But it's a simple one. And we got a plant 1000 barrel. Hope I'm saying that right. Let's get our uh, manure spreader here hooked up. I hate it when I do that. I'm going to go ahead and get unfolding the wings. And of course, y'all know me, GPS. Uh, let's see, get that all pull that about right there where it looks. I'm gonna go ahead and hit the thing there. We're set to go, and I spray and we go. Now, all I have to do is hit three on the keyboard, and I go auto uh, cruise. And folks, I'm going to take the satellite off for a second. This is enough time to hit that and then hit that. And the turns up here are kind of sharp, so I'm just going to go, let's see, 30. So I'm going to go about 14. And that was an auto save, y'all seen. I'm going to get rid of this square box. And take it down to this, that right there. But uh, where y'all can see a little bit better. And this gives me time to talk to y'all. First of all, I just want to say thank you so much for all the love and support. It really means a lot to me. 
but the 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 uh, comments are getting overwhelmed. Um, I need to back off of that just a little bit. Um, it'll be this right here. I need to set us fourteen. Let's go ten. But um. Let's see here. What I'm saying is about getting overwhelmed. I'm getting so many comments that I might not comment on every one. You know, if you ask me a question or something like that, I might just, uh, if, if you send me a question or something like that, I'll answer it. But if you're just saying uh, awesome video or, or, or thanks for sharing, I might just give you a heart. And don't think that it's not no different love there. I still love each and every one of y'all's comments, but I, I need something to help speed up and get through them. And if y'all have any advice at all how to do this, please let me know. Uh, I may not do it, but I will consider it and, and think about it. Um, I know that discourages. I, I used to watch a couple of YouTubers and they say that. And now I know what they mean, but I used to get discouraged. You know, like you don't even want to hear my comment anyway. I do want to hear your comment. I always read all the comments, but I might just throw some hearts and go on. You know what I mean? It's not taking no love away. It's just. It's actually helping me if y'all uh, love and appreciate my video and stuff. Y'all understand where I'm coming from when I say that. But uh, I'm going to try my best to reply to every comment. But, uh, just don't forget, you know, I got two kids, uh, mom and dad, basically life, you know. And... Uh, Sometimes it just gets it gets hard, but I do love each and every one of y'all. Y'all are awesome, awesome family I have. And as I'm recording this, I'm 17 members away from being 500, and that's really, really grateful on my behalf. You know, it's this. I never thought I would make it this far. So, 500 family members, I might do, I don't really don't know what I have planned for it. I want to do something special for y'all, but, you know, I, I don't have a job right now, and I ain't making no money on YouTube either. So I might come up with maybe a four or five hour live stream so we can all get in and talk to each other and stuff through it maybe. Um, might be at night time. I'm not for sure yet. But, you know, like I said, being a firefighter slash first responder and having two kids being the only parent and it gets rough so I'll think of something I know some of y'all been wanting to see my guns some of y'all want me to start vlogging again so I don't know maybe I do something with my drone and guns and a vlog uh, like a shooting vlog or something target practice I just don't want to YouTube to criticize me in any way when I do show my guns but you know how that is but uh, look at there folks we're over halfway done and what I'm doing I'm just helping me out by go ahead and fertilizing this and then I'm gonna turn around and buy it from her. 
Uh, way it looks, this program, well, this will be the first fertilizer on this. Um, so the, might get one more. We'll get the dry fertilizer down here and the uh, spreader box. I could really make some money uh, since we ain't got no animals. I'll buy some sheep and then turn around uh, sell every crop I got in the, in the bin and go from there if I can find a spot that will set fuel sales because digestate makes fuel fertilize dry well it makes fuel dry fertilize and liquid fertilize and also, we can sell our eggs. We ain't got very many eggs, but I have a uh, chicken box thing where you can sell your eggs. Uh, so that's going to come up good with like No Creek Farms and uh, Autumn Oaks, which y'all haven't seen yet. Um, been trying to. I got like six or seven episodes of Autumn Oaks recorded. And they'll probably be releasing pretty soon. We'll probably... I don't know. I don't. I really don't know which map I want to replace with Automotes. I might just start throwing that in there on like a Saturday special or something. Or maybe a Sunday. Because my No Creek Farms is, you know, through the week at 11.30 a.m. And then I got uh, Upper Mississippi River Valley, uh, of course, Shenettitons, and then Corn Belt. That's usually like twice a week. So Monday you get Upper Mississippi Valley, Tuesday, Shenettitons, Wednesday's Corn Belt, then Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. It just, you know, starts over in a different episode. All right, we're on our last through, looks like. If it was me doing this field myself, I would go across the ends first. Or shut it off right at the end to save some. Turn the camera here a little bit. Let's take a look inside this flint because I know y'all probably wanting to see that too. You know, first person view. It should have been in here in the first place. Prettier in here than it is outside. All those colorful buttons, those blue buttons there. Ooh, Mr. Blue loves blue. Blue and purple, that's my colors right now. It used to be red. You just had the nickname, instead of Mr. Blue, I had a nickname of Big Red. Had a 81 Ford Bronco, and it was red in color. Well, a tan top on it. Uh-oh, there we go. 2,638. You notice we don't get no time bonus with uh, the uh, season mods. All right. Now, it's not going to give us another mission. Let's see. But I actually thought about letting her raise this fail till the very last moment. I know that ain't right, but let's go to 18 real quick. And uh, we're getting pretty close to time this one's already up it's barley let's see what kind of mission we got here if we got any oh can't use that with that okay nope okay we can use that i might have a bigger path is that all it's going to give us i want to use a track track I'll tell you what, let's go ahead and do this. It's not very much money, but I just like seeing the different tractors. Look how narrow the tracks are. Is this the new new cat challenger? They're supposed to have redone the tracks on it. Wow. 
What? Oh, man. It won't hook up. Crap. See, that ain't going to do either. I'm going to have to. Wow. I, I love it, Elvis. A grayish plain, but. Oh, look at the stern wheel. Great. Buttons on the stern wheel. I like that. I'm going to go over here. I love the setup on the inside. Wow. Alright, uh, yep, mission failed. I hope I don't count against us. Alright, let's uh, start this mission. That's the new Hirsch Packer. It's got the Furlight Spreader. Wow, that's a big tractor to be running over to Barley, but. Oh, I like this the way the wheels turn. That's pretty neat. And the Hirsch pack here. All right, let's uh get spraying real quick. And your GPS locked on here. All those signs. Whoa. Okay. Let's get locked on right there. There we go. And I'm just going to back this just a, a little bit, probably about a six or seven. And it should turn this right for us. Oh, yeah. But check it out, folks. This is the new Hirsch buggy right here it's on tracks narrow tracks now that would be awesome for the uh, cat challenger that we just saw this thing holds 10,000 liters wow let's take a look inside and that's pretty neat I like that check out our tractor uh wow lights and stuff up there radio and Got the buddy seat. I like the way the wheels turn. That's pretty neat. I like the way the console and stuff set up. Not really no room on the back glass way it looks. But not bad. Not bad at all. We could really do some uh, tillage with this tractor. Big old, uh, good lord, look how wide this spreader is. It really covers the ground pretty good, though. You might have to buy one of these babies. Might have to trade two of those tractors in and get one of, us to, one of those cat challengers, too. That's pretty neat. Pretty neat. I gotta say so. Wow. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. That's one thing I hate about GPS, too. It stops at the last because it's not a full through. It tends to want to stop. This tractor runs 32 mile an hour too. Wow. Now I'm doing this myself. That's why I'm not on GPS right there. Matter of fact, we can go ahead and get rid of the GPS box. Because we're just about to finish this. Look like our. Uh, oh no, it's field 17. Alright, you're 183. Not really that much, but. 
brought the value down a little bit and got it fertilized. Let's check on field 17 before we go. And uh, I'll probably start this mission, but I'm not going to actually finish it. Uh, well, not finish it on camera. That's what I mean. Okay, uh, not bad. Yeah, we got to get this field price down lower. A million dollars. Of course, we're almost at a million. We just got to get some more trees. Let's go ahead and do it with the Hirsch. Uh, let's see, we start the tractor up. I don't think I'm going to worry about that weight because I have to turn around. I want to try to get much of this done as possible. Alright. Auto width. Let's just go ahead and copy it right there. Turn this way. And then we're going to do the outer turn per uh, seven. And go from there. We should be all set. And it should turn. Whoa, why is it not turning? Why, why did you not turn? Ah, oh, turn the GPS off. Oh, oh my god. Oh, slow down, slow down. There we go. God, I'm so stupid. I, t I turned it off, and there's my stupid controller again. Now, pardon me just a second while I fix this. Okay. That's what it does when I lay my controller down or 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 bump it like that or something they'll get and they'll just start turning on its own like that right there. Alright, we should be good to go this time as long as I don't turn the GPS off. What I've done is the control uh period on the keypad I hit zero and it shuts the GPS off. So, but anyway, folks, I'm 27 minutes in, and I've been having some long videos here lately, so I'm going to go ahead and get off this. Um, Y'all seen the price tag and everything, so I'm going to finish this video. And I kind of forgot about the planner. Jennifer's still going? Jennifer is done with seven. Okay, um, so I got field eight to plant. Oh, Lord. Um, folks, we'll just plant field eight next time we come in. We'll plant eight and then probably speed up time and try to get 17, 18, 19 in our possession. Um, so we'll probably be planting field 8 and doing some more woodwork. Yeah, I know y'all hate that word. But we got to do something to make some money to get those fields. Uh, I don't know exactly how much money we got now. I think it was 600000 600, somewhere. But, uh, yeah. That's the plan, anyway. Um... So, uh, once again, folks, appreciate all the love and support. Uh, please leave a comment, even on what I said. Uh, I do read them. I just might not be able to answer all of them the way I want to. I might just throw a heart in there. Um, sure if you just give me a thumbs up or, 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 or a couple of thumbs up and some of those weird symbols, uh, the fruits and stuff, which I love them. It still shows love and support and being on my channel uh, it's nothing against them just i just might throw a heart and a thumbs up back and uh but anyway folks i love each and every one of y'all and i gotta go so till next time y'all have a great day a blessed day and i will see y'all later all right bye